Hi guys, welcome back to your channel Technical Sahil. So guys, in this video, we are going to see how we can deploy a server on Hexanal Cloud and install Windows on it. So without any further delay, let's get started. So I have already logged in into my Hexanal account. Uh, if you are new to this platform, I'll provide the sign up link in the description of this video. When you sign up through my affiliate link, you will get a 20 euros free credit, which you can use to build your own server. So right now we don't have any servers. So we need to click add server. Our location, I am choosing US, United States East. And OS images, I am choosing 18.04. Don't worry, we'll install Windows, but this is for the first time configuration. And I am going with the standard. And this 6.40 euro per month, which has 4 GB of RAM and 3 core CPUs and 80 GB of SSD storage and 20 TB of traffic means bandwidth, which is, I think, a good configuration. We don't need this public IPv6. Uh, you can rename it anything. I am just renaming it for the reference. And we are all set. We need to click this create and buy now. This will take some time to deploy. It's provisioned. So we need to check by clicking on this console button. Yeah, it has provisioned successfully. So we need to close this console window and we need to click this ISO images. And we need to search for in this video, I am installing Windows 2019. You can install any image like 2012, 2016, 19, 22, any version you want. So in the second page, I guess maybe I find 2019, yeah. So we need to click this mount button. Uh, I am selecting Windows Server 2019 English variant. So we need to click this mount button. After that, we need to turn off this machine. And we need to click turn on again. And click this console button. So it has started booting our windows. Now we can set this default English United States. You can change if you want. I am going with the default. We can also use mouse like if we tick this button uh, GUI. If we check this GUI mode, then our mouse will be also enabled. Now we need to click install now. Please select Windows Server 2019 standard desktop experience here and click next. I accept the license terms. You can read if you want. Otherwise, just check and click next. Now, please select custom install Windows only here. Now, we need to install drivers. Right now, we don't have any driver. So, we need to first Mount this virtual win 0.1.215 ISO file. Uh, you will find it on the first page uh, in the second row. Click mount here. And after that, click load driver. Click browse here. Explore the CD drive. Scroll down a bit and explore this VIO SCSI. And now explore this 2K19. Select this folder. Click OK. 
we have got our driver file so we need to click install here don't worry about the slow cursor uh, once we are done with the configuration we will connect our rdp in uh, windows rdp option so right now it's a default uh, we need to delete all these drives because we want to create our custom so select and delete one by one now select this one click delete and ok now we need to create this new one click apply press ok now again we need to mount our windows uh, 2019 file which is i guess yeah on the second page uh, we need to click mount here and then we need to uh, select this second one second drive and we need to click next now it has process our installing it will take some time till then i am fast forwarding this video So guys, as you can see, the installation of our window ISO has been done. And now we can unmount this because the purpose of our mounting the ISO 2019 windows image has been also done. So we can unmount this and, and let's wait for the loading. Our username is my administrator and we need to set a password. Uh, please make a strong password otherwise it will not gonna allow you like one two three four five um i forgot the password uh, wait a minute yeah i'm done with the password uh, now we need to click this finish button Now we need to click this control or delete which is here in the bottom. Now we need to enter our password which we have settled a minute ago. So guys as you can see our windows server has been installed but uh, we are not done yet uh, we need to do few more things first we need to click on these tools and click this computer management second option and we need to enable our ethernet port so we need to click this device manager and right click this ethernet controller and we need to click this update driver click browse my computer for driver software uh, we need to again mount our virtual file virtual iso file click mount here
and now click browse here explore this cd drive and explore expand this net kvm folder please find your version uh, mine is 2k19 so again expand this directory and select this folder amd64 and click ok and we need to click next so it has enabled our internet now i guess we are done with this console window so now we just need to open it into our rdp so i am closing this window and copy this ip and i may found it here but you need to search rdp in case if you are not finding it and we need to copy the ip here and show more options and username is administrator Uh, we got an error like remote desktop can't connect to okay okay i i understand uh, we need to do one more thing uh, in this console window open my files uh, wait a minute this pc uh click properties uh click remote settings here now we need to select this radio button allow remote connections to this computer and click on apply then okay and now i think we are done with the console window i hope so now again we need to try connect and uh, we need to enter our password I click yes here So guys as you can see our rdp has been connected and now we can access this through our, our remote desktop connection and the internet is also enabled so that's all for this video i hope after this video you may be able to deploy your own windows server on hexner cloud console i have also created a separate videos for walter and same for digital ocean as well uh, wait a minute if you want to deploy the same on digital ocean and walter as well so you can watch this video i may provide the link in the description and if you are new to this channel uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button and if you like that video make sure you hit the like button if you are new to this hexner cloud uh, sign up through my link and you will get a free 20 euro credit which would be helpful for you uh, to building a server uh, for free of course like this server is 6.40 euros so per month so if you get your 20 euros you can build these type of services uh, for a three months for free of course you don't have to pay anything okay then i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching